What to do, everybody? It's your boy Nocturne, and I have to admit, I've been very addicted to this game. Belheim, I'm sure a lot of you have heard about it. Uh, over the past, like, week, I think I've played, like, 50 hours. I know that's not a lot compared to some of you out there, but I've just been playing this almost non-stop. I played it for, like, 11 hours the other day, and I know I want to be playing, like, Dreamscaper and, like, the um, Tale of the Forgotten thing, like I mentioned in my little update video, but I've just been completely addicted to this game. Uh, at first I was really against recording because I'm like, oh, my playthrough is just going to be kind of, oh, what the fuck is clearing? Kind of similar to like everyone else's. And it's like, oh, look at me. I'm running around. I'm building and stuff. Oh, I'm going to go explore or whatever. And that was my initial thought. I don't really know what I'm going to do with this, but I really wanted to play it and I need something recorded to edit this week. So here we go. But I guess I'll start off by just going through my little, uh, place here. It's not like the most impressive thing. Uh, this at first start off as just like it was a little abandoned house on this little hill overlooking the river and then I expanded it out a little bit and I've just started building things as I've uh, found them or discovered them but uh it's like my little little smelter area where I can cook stuff too and yeah I just I don't really know what to do for the roof like I wish I came up with like a better design I'm still like fairly I say I'm fairly new but like I haven't really Oh, that bothers me. Why is... Why is that uneven? Oh, hold up. Hold up. <laughs> there. That's better. Probably gotta do the other side now. Ugh. Wait, I don't have wood? Where's the other wood? Did I miss some over here? No. Probably fell inside my house. Anyway, this is my house. Uh, I just have some random storage stuff. This is a nice little... Little balcony area to look over things is inside it's very cramped because like i said this was just like a little abandoned house and i used to have a whole bunch of normal storage chests in here but i replaced them all with the reinforced chest for bare storage don't know where my wood disappeared off to i guess uh <laughs> i just have to redo those but I'm gonna sleep the night away there we go much more uniform actually that's like the top of my chest there damn all right cool Okay, that's taken care of. Back to the tour. Uh, just for, forget you didn't you didn't see any of this. You didn't see any of that. <clears throat> all right. Uh, I got all my like workbench upgrades here. My workbench is inside. This is a random portal I made just because I had the materials. These are all my other different portals. One goes to the swamp, which is all the way up here, and there's like more swamp up here I haven't explored. And then the other one goes to the elder, which is right here. And then this one is currently my explore one, so whenever I'm out exploring, I need to come back. I think right now, I think right now it's like up here. That's where I left off last time I played. And I need to go all the way up here. So that is probably what I'm going to be going to today. I really don't want to make a boat to get up there, so I'm going to see how far this goes. I haven't seen how far this goes, but I want to see how far this goes. So that's what we'll be doing today as well as... If we do happen to find it... Oh, are these done growing? Okay, they're not done growing. Um, as far as... What is it? It's the bone mass, right? So, a bone mass. That that suggests it's probably weak to blunt damage, and someone told me that the mace is really good for that. So, I'll probably make a mace and upgrade it as... Uh, I've already gone and upgraded, like, my sword and, like, all of my armor, well, except for the control cape. I know I could probably use the deer cape and get like one more little armor thing but this looks so much better with blue but this is like my little armory area i don't really know what to do with this i'll probably turn it into like storage up there like all my forge upgrades this is where like my ore is and random nails i find along the way my stone cutter so yeah uh let's see that's my garden i kind of didn't really mention that this is where i brew stuff uh i wanted to have a lot more than two but this just looks so nice like i can't get over this look and I don't really know what to make this up here I just kind of put this little throne thing here because looks cool I guess I don't know I'll, I'll turn this into like a gathering area or something like that so yeah that's that building and I show you my home. and these every time I find a queen bee I try and build more beehives but oh my god oh my god I don't <laughs> I don't need any more and it's becoming a problem Ooh, I could I could fit one up there maybe no, I, I really shouldn't. But anyway, all right, enough dawdling. I need, number one, I'm out of sausages. So we're just going to stick those bad boys in 
there and I'll probably make more when I come back. And then I'm going to need... What is need for a mace? I know I need iron. I have tons of it left over. I just don't know if I have enough to fully upgrade a mace. No, that's bronze. Iron. 20. And then four wood, three leather scraps. Okay. Boop. Now I haven't really used maces, which is actually going to be like... Because I've been using swords mainly in level 50. I have not used... Where's maces? Or clubs? I guess it counts as a club. I guess. I used a wooden club, but... So I guess I'll just craft a mace and uh, work on that. Up until I don't need to anymore. And then... It takes 10 iron. I know I'm going to need a lot of iron later. I really don't want to use it all right now, but... If it's going to help me with the boss... Wait, no, no! <sighs> Rob, if you're watching this, I got an iron mace for you, because I just... Oh, that is so sad. I can't believe I just did that. That is such a waste of... Ah, Alright, well... How much, did I, how much iron did I just lose by doing that? I lost 20. Which would have been this whole upgrade. And then I would have had 22 left. Okay, I wouldn't have... I would have been really upset if that was like just enough for me to fully upgrade it. But I didn't have enough iron for that. So I... I feel a little better. But I will need to go get iron at some point. But now... I have a level 3 mace for whenever um, for whenever I really find the boss. Alright, and we're back off into the world. And we're going to see just how far we can, how close we can. I, should, I do this every time. I break the workbench first without breaking the portal. Boop. Boop. Alright. And I kind of like moving these over here. Can I separate them? Okay. Yeah, so we're all the way up here in comparison to where I just was. Okay. Back out into the world. And normally what I was doing is I've been like just kind of running back and forth getting all this land as you can see here. But I probably won't be doing that for this video as much as I want to. Because I don't want to waste that. Oh, 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 oh. That's a plains biome. That's... That is not where I need to... Oh, God. Oh, good lord. That is a massive plains biome. Okay. I might not be able to... Uh, there's a chest here. Doubt it has anything useful, but I'll take it. Why is there a plains biome here? For those of you who don't know, plains biome is like an end game zone. I think it's like the last place you go to or need to go to. So, I mean, I could survive maybe one hit. <laughs> with my current gear, I think. One or two hits with my current gear. Or maybe more. I don't know. I've only had to fight death mosquitoes. So I'm not actually quite sure. Oh, <gasps> like that. Oh, ow. Okay, that's not too bad. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, good lord. You see how much damage that they did to me, though? Good god. Okay, so I can survive quite a few hits from a death mosquito. That, that's that's good to know. Oh, the question is, do I want to make a portal for the plant? I mean, I could and just come back to it later. All right, I know I said I wasn't going to do this, but I just want to get this little thing out of the way, and then we'll keep going up north to this bone mass is going to be a long time. What do we have here? Right, well, here we go. We're swimming across. We have a long way to go. Why does there have to be a plane spy over here? Why? Abandoned house. Alright, every time I see a beehive, I'm always like, well, let's just get it. And the only thing they're used for is making more beehives, so I don't really know why I'm making more of these, or getting more of these, but I am. I guess for whenever I make another base, it'll be nice, but that is... Hmm. So that's mountains, that's... Am I really gonna... <sighs> I don't want to make a boat. I really... I really don't want to make... Oh, I never removed these. Okay the legs at least. I really don't want to have to make a boat. 
I've been avoiding it this whole time because boating to me is really stressful. Because as soon as you see a sea serpent, it's just like, oh god, oh god, oh god. Yeah, that's a plains biome on my map. Ah, oh, close is it? It's just right over that hill. Okay. I am going to have to make a boat because as far as I know, like over here, there's not really like any other land over here. It's just ocean. Yeah, I'll just have to make the boat. The only thing is, I'm not sure I have enough iron for the nails because, well, I could just make, because there's a long ship that takes a lot of materials. I don't know if I can, I don't know what the difference is between the long ship and a carve, which is obviously like. You know, one is obviously more durable than the other one, but I don't know if this needs, like, more people to operate. Because if it does, I don't really have more people to do that with right now. You know, screw it. I'm going to look it up <laughs> before I waste my materials. Only needs one person, so maybe I will just make that, and then I can destroy it afterwards when I'm done with it. Uh, okay. I, will you leave me alone? Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. A lot of this video is just going to be me going, oh, <laughs> okay. So I need 100 nails, deer hide, fine wood, ancient bark. I think I have all of that except for the nails, right? One bar per 10, which means I would need 10 bar. Oh, I do need more iron. Now I have enough bronze for just the... 80 nails. Doesn't it take... Doesn't it make 20, though? It does take 20. I will be right back. I'm gonna go get copper. Yes. I'm gonna go get copper. Yeah, I'm not really sure if I'm gonna be recording more of this in the future. I just... I honestly need something to edit this week. And, like, I do have more blue fire I could edit, but I feel like um, I'm gonna wait on that just for a little bit, because... I don't know. I just kind of didn't feel like editing that this week and this has just been like this game has been fresh on my mind like i'll wake up and be like all right jump on velheim or i'll be leaving a friend's house and be like all right velheim i'll be just going to sleep it's just velheim like i've been seriously addicted to this game so i figure i guess i'll record it i guess a bunch of my friends were telling me to record it because i've been playing it so much so here we are don't know what to make of it uh this will probably just be like not a lot of editing will probably go into this, or maybe it will, I don't know. This might just be like one of those really chill recordings, you know, you just kind of throw in the background, listen to it as you do your, uh, whatever tasks you're doing at home or wherever you're at, and, uh, just be really chill. Super exciting content, everybody. Yeet. Mining. <laughs> One of my things about this game that I kind of don't like is with how much, like, obvious traveling you do around this world, which is huge, by the way. Um, while you have teleporters, you cannot teleport ores or the bars you turn them in. Unless you turn them into, like, equipment or something. So my question is, why? Because that means most of the like, well, okay, maybe not most of the game, but that means... If I were to teleport to the swamp, I actually timed it, right? Um, even using my, like, run ability I have. From here, which is where my swamp teleporter is, from all of these that I have actually excavated, it takes me, like, seven minutes, seven and a half minutes to run from there all the way back to my home base. Now, granted, you're probably telling yourself, oh, well, you can just make a base up here smelt all the stuff there, and then you can teleport. And it's like, well, I say to you, that is technically correct, and I'm not going to say that you're wrong, because you're not. I will say to you that I do not want to have to build a smelter out all the way into the swamp just so I can bring stuff back as equipment and then leave whatever iron I have left over over there. It's just... Ugh, it's so annoying. It is so annoying. Because, like, so... Where this is, for example. It's like, well, or like the planes, right? I'm assuming the planes probably has its own ore. And if I have to constantly build new places just to smelt things, even if it is temporary, I just, it's so annoying. And I just feel like that's so, that shouldn't be, 
like sure you can encourage people to build like outposts and stuff which i would love to build like out here and stuff it's just not what i'm doing right now because eventually yeah like this place is just gonna be not not enough for well maybe not like enough for me but it's like i like where i'm lit <sighs> you creep i hate you odin i know this does nothing to you but get out of here leave leave you want to hear my war cry <laughs> that's right leave get out of here all right <sighs> i was not expecting him to be right there when i crest over the hill what a creep dude oh my god just right there waiting for me <laughs> yeah that's like my only complaint is that like just let us take ores through the thing because you can easily like a thing to get around it i've found is that you can just make another world so well, okay before i say that to kind of explain how um felheim works so your character so like my character right here is um like his inventory and everything if i were to log into someone else's world like like think of minecraft for those of you who played minecraft like you log into someone's world you don't keep any of your stuff that was on you in a different server right but you keep your skin and this you keep all of your inventory with you wherever you go so if you really wanted to let's say your friend just started playing Velheim, they've got 30 minutes into the game if you really wanted to be that person you could go into their game drop all the highest level of gear for them to use and then leave if you if you really wanted to not saying you should do that but I'm saying you could if you really would like to. So what you do to transport things faster is you can just make a separate world, which I am guilty of doing this because I'm tired of running back and forth. Because I've already had to run iron before. It's like I'll run it the first time. And if I've proven that I can, you know, actually survive and get back to my base with all this stuff, then it's like, okay, I, I don't feel the need to do that again. So it just takes so much time. Like it would have taken me. I think it did take me the first time I went through all these. It took me an hour. It was just like an hour of running back and forth, back and forth. And it's just, it's ridiculous. It is ridiculous. I just don't think that, I just think that should be changed in my, in my honest opinion. This is just very obnoxious. Oh, is this, is this gonna not be like, Okay, it literally spawns in the air and drops. Okay, I was like, what is this about? Oh boy. I'm really nervous. This is my first time on a boat. But. Well, not my first time on a boat. It's not my first time on a boat, but the last time I was on a boat, it was absolutely terrifying because there were sea serpents. I'm going to take damage from these rocks. Never mind, I won't. All right. But as long as I stay away from the actual ocean biome or... At least some ways away from the plains biome, too. Okay. Then I should be... Okay. And we're off on adventure and potential death. I don't like how open this is getting. Uh, it's a nice mountain up there. We have a long way to go. I actually need to go that way. Which means... I might need to cross the open ocean. That is a big, what is that? That is a giant. Dang. It's a dead, I saw a dead mosquito for a second. I, I've never crossed the open ocean and I really don't want to, but I feel like I have to. We're going gamers. We're going. We don't have full wind, so I won't be able to escape a sea serpent if one does spawn out here. And I don't know if there's anything worse than sea serpents, but if there is, I will probably find out. This land isn't too far away, and I still have some wind, so I'm hoping, hoping and praying. Oh god, not in the ocean biome yet. I'm so scared. I'm, I'm absolute okay. Oh God. Cause it can just spawn in front of me and I won't know. Oh, I'm technically in a black forest biome. What? It really expands out all the way out here. Oh, okay. I don't like that. Well, we're gonna try and hug closer towards 
Okay, now I'm in the ocean. I don't like that. Go, go towards the... Oh. oh, God. Okay, I'm at paddling speed because I don't have the wind with me. You know what? No, it's worth going this way to get the wind. Please get me out of this open ocean. You know what? Okay, I'm just going to go straight into the land. Black forest. Okay. Okay, no sea serpents. Storms are probably going to cause up again because I think the black forest... Yeah. It's very weird, like... Biomes are, like, tied to their own weather in this, so... If one black force is having a storm, I think all the black force are having a storm. I think is just how it works. Oh, land, sweet land. Oh, my goodness. Oh. It's really unfortunate that this ended there, but... Can't expect the whole thing to connect. I'm actually getting a lot closer. If it's not plains throughout here and it's just a black forest, I might be able to just go on foot. Oh, well, there's more black forest over there. Oh, that's a rock. Oh. Okay, that wasn't that wasn't much damage, but still not appreciated. I just want to get past this. Uh, I'm in the ocean. Oh no, but I'm next to a swamp. Can I make it to the other side? I don't know. Please, please see I'm in the swamp. It's saying I'm in the ocean. Okay, there we go. There we go. Ha. Oh. God. Because I'm pretty sure if you're in an ocean biome, the sea serpents will attack you. But if you're in the swamp biome or like just something that's not the ocean, it won't attack you. That was at least my experience. Don't know if that's true. Don't quote me. Black forest. What? I'm not in the black forest. I'm next to a swamp. Silly game. Okay, this is still going on for a while. We're getting fairly, like, decently closer to the boss. Which I honestly wasn't expecting to get this close today. Um, okay, this is... I'm going to say the accursed words. This is going better than I expected. <laughs> Excuse me. Pirates be damned. There it is on my mini-map. That's how close I am. All right. Let's find... Ooh, okay, is that not planes up there? If that's not planes, then I might set up there, because the swamp has leeches and stuff, and I don't want to leave my boat with leeches. Ooh, that looks like a black forest. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. All right, this is going good. What was that? I just, like... I could have swore I just heard something, but... The low humming... Okay, it says I'm in the plains. I don't understand. Is this plains? No, this should be black forest, right? Yeah, black forest. Okay, I guess that tiny little outcrop of land was like plains. I guess. What a journey. Like, I know nothing really happened, but I was stressed that whole time. What's <laughs> the range workbench? Wait, can I not destroy a boat? To reclaim the materials? I cannot destroy a boat to reclaim its materials. I can repair it though. Alright, that's noted. Well, I didn't really lose much, so... I should probably find a better spot for it though. Wait, use ladder. It's not a ladder. Ladder's like over here. By better spot, I just mean we're probably going to hug it up against these rocks. I know it'll probably take damage over time, but I don't know if like the waves can carry it away. And I can always just wedge it out of these rocks later, if need be. Yeah, that's fine. I'll just repair you again. All right, there we go. Gonna get my workbench back. This is very lucky, at least to me. I don't know what like normal spawns are for like this sort of thing to happen, but the fact that there's a, a biome that I know is safe, that isn't a swamp, it's not a plains, that is just right next door to uh, the boss I'm going to. That, to me, is nice. Uh, we're probably going to set up here, just as a tiny little... Tiny little shack for the portal, maybe a chest or two. Grayling is taking some interest. Some Graylings. Oh, you're probably from that little thing over there. 
He did 0.5 damage, geez. Okay, I need to stop getting distracted. Um, where is, there it is. Wait, how much wood did I get from killing those guys? 26, 10 of it will be for the workbench. I might have to get more wood. I'm one of those people who like when it comes to, um, when it comes to like crafting these sort of things, I always make like a tiny hut and Rob usually gets very upset with me. He's like, this is only temporary. I don't know why you're doing all, putting all this effort in. And I'm just like, it needs to look good. It does, it does need to look good. Especially because I don't know how long I'm gonna be here. Um, so we're just gonna go ahead and create the portal here. There we go. I'm just gonna go get a whole bunch of wood, come back and build something. All right, so I guess we are gonna fight Bone Mass today. I wasn't expecting, I was honestly expecting to die in the, oh God, it's storming outside. I was expecting to die at the ocean because I thought maybe a sea serpent or something was going to come and get me. You know what, I'll, screw it, I'll take a whole stack. Uh, dum -de -dum -de -dum. Nope. Wait. Uh, sorry, I get distracted very easily. It's like, all right, let's go fight a boss. Oh wait, all my honey. I need to go get it. All right, it's 48 honey, which is a lot. God, I'm gonna. Ha I might honestly, yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. We're just gonna stick you over here. This whole other chest I have is just going to be strictly for honey, because I have too much. Is there any- oh, poison resistance potions, definitely, because it is in a swamp. I don't know if the boss does poison damage. I don't think I will need more than- mm, well, we'll take four. And just for some quality assurance. Take four of those. And these are minor staminas. I'll take I'll take three. Yeah. Put those there. Eat um nom nom. Oh, oh. I can worry about my crops later. Screw it. Alright, let's go. And I'll build a little hut and then we will kill this bossarino. Uh how if I want it to be even. You know what? We're going to remake the workbench over here. This part of the video is probably going to drive Rob crazy because he's like, oh my god, just build it this way because it's only temporary. And I'm to that, I say, screw you, Rob. I build it how I want. How big is this portal? It's going to be roughly two walls, basically. So it doesn't need to be bigger than this, but we will make another one. The door will be that big. Uh, yeah. Can I rip? <laughs> All right. And just because I can, we'll have a little viewing port here. Make this a little bigger on the top. It only takes one wood. Ah, saving the world. Ah, always legs. So now we have a nice little window there. I don't know why I should get that. Do I want a gate? I don't need a gate, but uh, which side will the door be on? Actually, it can be on this side. Yeah, I want it on this side. All right. Door, yes. The fact that it doesn't touch the ground kind of bothers me, but Mmm, that really bothers me, but whatever. Why am I a perfectionist? I don't know, but I'm ignoring my perfectionist needs right now by just going along with this. Uh, there we go. Alright, hut acquired. Uh, we're gonna add 
these, make it look a little bit, just, just a little bit more. And uh, just because we can. <laughs> See? Alright, that looks nice. I like how that looks. Just a nice little, nice little hut. this. We can have a campfire here. I don't have the stones. But that's fine. That'll be something for later. I guess the window is just going to be a view of the portal, I guess, but it's all good. I can't... Oh. oh I can I move it a little further back? Because I am that person it is not sticking out on the sides. Perfect. And because I'm also that same person, uh, I want to build a campfire. <laughs> is this tilting you yet, Rob? Is this tilting you? This is just for you. Just for you, Rob. I don't know if you're going to actually watch this video, but if you do, this is all just for you. Perfect. Where do I want this fire? <laughs> it's very cramped in here. Screw it. Bone mass. Right, we have connection. Now, the one thing I do kind of want to test is when I come through this portal, am I going to instantly catch on fire or take smoke damage? Because <laughs> if not, I might just get rid of the bonfire. I don't really need it. It's just for that. That the little extra touch to it. I can't breathe in smoke. Oh, okay. I'm fine. So I just have to be careful when I come out of it. Um, that seems to filter the smoke out just fine. Also gives me a slight rested bonus. Now, do I also barricade this off? I think I might want to, but that might be something for another day as I don't actually have that much wood, but I can definitely start on something here. Are you upset yet, Rob? I know I, I know I keep calling out Rob, but it's like um, there was one time where we literally like landed a boat, right? And we were just supposed to make a, a portal and all that good stuff. But I was sitting here taking some time to just kind of fix up the little shack that we had set up in for the portal, and he didn't realize what I was doing. He was mainly just wondering why I was taking so long. <laughs> and I think now, oh, he knows now, obviously, but. I just, I find it funny. Okay, well, I need four more wood. Oh, that's, that's from the plains. What are you doing here? I didn't block any of that. That was not good. Ow. Okay, well, I killed him, at least. Black metal scrap. I don't think I'm supposed to get this yet. Uh, gonna drink a healing potion, cause holy crap. <gasps> oh, that's the potion activating, alright. Okay. I can't teleport with that. That's great. Just lovely. That's exactly what I wanted. So water did come up in here earlier. Um, doesn't really seem to have affected the fire, so that's fine. Uh, oh no, uh, furniture, chest, and black metal. There we go. I guess I just have that now. Ugh. Don't really know what to do with that, considering it's like an end game. Oh wait, I need 10. Considering it's like an end game kind of thing. Well, that wasted a lot of time, but I'm ha- Hold up. <laughs> oh, oh my god. BRB. Felheim, why do you do this? Top 10 anime betrayals. That's gonna bother me, but... Whatever. Especially since I got that, that the way it is. I think the only other way I can really do it is if I, like, I don't know, connected it from the side or something. But I'm, I'm not... Screw it. I've, I've used up so much time already. I just... Ugh. <laughs> okay, so I know Rob is gonna yell at me, but I kind of just moved everything around because it was kind of bothering me but all right enough of that God. 
Why do I get sidetracked so much in this game? It's like a Minecraft all over again. Can I actually jump over there? Aha, yes, I can. Okay. So, I should eat. I do have to go into a plains biome for a quick second. As... As evidenced by the goblins that came and attacked me. Oh, that's a death mosquito. See, why is there a plane? This is the tiniest little plains biome. All right, death mosquito, come here. Man, no quills or anything. You always suck. Oh, there it is. Haha. -ha. This is such a tiny plains biome. What is this? No, nothing. No death mosquitoes around. Bite me in my butt. All right. Kind of curious what to see what this, uh, this boss arena looks like. From the looks of it, it doesn't really look like an arena at all. Read the runestone. Cook their remains. I do have the things necessary. Oh, hello. Okay, let me. Let me leeches around. Swamps are home to a bunch of leeches, typically. I'm honestly really nervous. Is that a leech? No, that's a rock. I heard that. What is... There's a giant oozer over there. Good lord. Should I kill that first? Technically should, but I think I'll be fine. No leeches, really. Interesting. All right. Well, got my poison res. All right. Wait, I need to put it in my thing. Boop. Yeah, two ball ten. All right. I don't know what this thing is gonna look like, but I just know it's a skeleton thing. Okay, I don't like that. I. That is not what I thought it would look like at all. Oh! Well, that didn't, that didn't do anything, actually. Oh, okay. What is the best way to fight this thing? Ow, that didn't work. Uh, sausages eat. Well, let's just try arranging it for now. That, ah, oh, that's a blob. Ugh. That is doing like nothing. So I'll just kill the blob. Woo. Go ahead and drink a potion. Can't use another one for. Ah, oh, crap. Ooh, that was a big AOE field. Okay. I haven't done hardly any damage. Oh, it just stays there, too. Alright, smack me. Okay, so after a parry, you get. Okay. Any more stamina? Yeah, you get a good attack window whenever you parry. Oh, God, he's doing the AOE. No! No, 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 no. Alright. That's more blobs. I don't like you. Oh, that just one shot it. All right. Whoa. Oh, ran out of stamina there. Whew. Okay, this isn't too bad now that I've kind of seen what it can do. Alright, which way are you going? Come over this way. Oh, dang. Oh, I can't block that because I messed up my block timing. Then you're going to AoE, right? That's what you've done so far. You've done two attacks and oh, you're throwing an ooze. Now you're gonna AoE when I'm out of stamina. I love you so much. I think I heard, wait. 
That was an ooze. I heard you. Oh, that or that was a leech, not an ooze. But those are oozes. That's a lot. Okay, okay, okay. Nope. Ah, oh, I got poisoned. God. Okay, well, I can drink a healing potion if I need to. I would just like to not. Oh, that AoE field is so huge. That's another ooze I didn't realize was a thing. Ow! I'm just gonna go ahead and drink one of those for safety. Ooh. Drink one of those. Ooh. Okay, oh. It's not even at half health yet. Oh, lag, because the world saved, I think. I couldn't even have enough stamina to kill him. Oh. I mean, I'm pretty sure I can do this. I just need to keep track of my health, keep track of all the oozes, go from there. That does like nothing. Can you come out of there, please? Oh, I thought he made oozes with those. Oh, there it is. Why is it on the branch? Yeah, I got this. Okay, and then he's gonna AOE. Where's that blob? Where's the other blob? I know there's another one. Oh, I mistimed that. Ow. Gonna AOE? No? Okay, he's gonna do the blob summon attack. Ah, oh, God, I wasn't ready for that. Ugh. Okay, I can take a little bit more before I need to really try and heal again. Oh, why? Oh. oh, okay. I need to heal. There we go. That's my last healing potion, too. Ah, uh, God. I mean, he's almost dead. I got this. Alright. Not when he decides to do that. I still got poisoned. Crap. Okay, what's my health? 80? I should be okay. Just regen my stamina. Let him come to me. Yeah, I got this. One more hit. Come on. Oh, really? Go for it. Okay, God. That was kind of anticlimactic, but... Wishbone. Bone mass. We did it, though. We did it. We came to the swamp. Well met. Oh, crow man. Hello. I need... I want to pick up some of this. All right. What you got for me? Seems one of many bones this living ossuary hid in his belly was a wishbone. This bone contains powerful magic that guides you to things hidden in the earth. It can locate silver veins. It may also lead you to buried treasure. Okay. Cool. So I got a wishbone and I got basically his head, essentially. <laughs> so I can put it on the sacrificial altar. Who I will say, I didn't even try using my sword once, but the mace seemed to do pretty well in that situation. So how does this work? You can sense hidden objects. Well, right, but how does it... Okay, so it stays equipped. So how does it work? I guess I'll just keep it equipped and see if it does anything. Oh, you can only have one at a time. Okay. 
Oh, I didn't. <laughs> I didn't have my shield. God dang it. That's a lot of death mosquitoes. Uh, it's only two. I I should be fine. Oh, you bitch! I missed. Oh, come at me. That's not good. Okay. All right. Fine. There we go. Oh, what are those things? Are they hostile? It's the planes. I'm assuming they're hostile. Locks. They just killed that thing. Okay. I don't know where the death mosquito went, but... You know what? I'm right next to base. Hello? Oh, okay. They throw spears. Okay, you are hostile. Alright. Good to know, but I have to get rid of- Why am I stuck on the bush? Oh my god! <laughs> okay. The planes are scary. Oh! These things are terrifying. I'm pretty sure those could one-shot me. You know what? I'm thinking. Alright, once he moves again. And settles down in an area. Settle yourself. Come on. Alright, got him. I'm gonna risk getting these things. Hello. Okay, either they're very nearsighted, or they're just fairly passive. Like, they're, they're obviously interested in me, but not angry. So that's good. No more death mosquitoes. Okay. Alright, can I cook some of the food? Everything is now organized. Then I'm gonna go... Because I realized I didn't actually sacrifice any of the boss's heads on my world still, because... Uh, I just didn't have to. I used to just play on Rob's world, and I don't use the Elder's power, which is just cutting wood faster. Is either cutting wood faster or more efficiently? I just, I don't use I just use the one where you run around, um, use less stamina. Stamina? Stamina. <laughs> Alright, so I'll offer... Boop. Oh. I didn't even know you could read these. The other kind of looks uh, kind of like Slender Man. Uh, not gonna lie. No, I could have could have kind of gotten a hit at what the, the bone mass was like if I came and looked at this. Just a big blob, blob man. Ooh, resistance versus physical damage. Blunt slash pure. That's really good. So you definitely want to you take that in for future boss battles. What do I have next? A dragon. And something with a crown. Skeleton crown looking thing. Good lord. But alright. So I got that. So that's that's progress. And I have the wishbone. I know it's supposed to help me find silver. But I'm not really sure where to find silver. I guess I need to go into the mountains now. Okay, so yeah. Something to do with a mountain biome. Which I do have a few mountains to select from in this area so the closest ones actually this is also a mountain area too i haven't heard my wishbone go off so I'm assuming i haven't found anything oh there's a wolf okay they do do quite a bit of damage but i'm all right hello Come to take your silver and your uh, obsidian, I think is what the wiki said. There we go. There is the parry. Ooh, one shot parry. Let's go. I can use these wolf. I think the wolf pelts are used for the armor too, but I'm gonna need a lot of silver. Hello, hidden deposits of silver. Where are you? And obsidian too. Oh, this is obsidian. All right. 
Oh, cool. Ooh, new stuff. Awesome. Biome, and I'm assuming... Oh, no, obsidian can be teleported. Good to know. Hello. Ow. Ooh, a wolf fang? Was this used for? Still sharp. I didn't get any new recipes, so... I probably don't have all the ingredients for whatever that could be used for. Um, is there just no silver on this mountain? Which I would, I would believe it. it just kind of kind of sucks, but... I mean, at least some more obsidian would be nice. You could at least throw some more of that my way. It's really disappointing. I mean, it might just be the fact that this one just didn't have any so i'll go look on the next mountain let's see these look black to me but they're just rocks i think i just need to see it again and actually absorb what the hell it looks like because obviously i'm oh hey wolfie wolf goodbye oh no i need your hide come back i'm gonna take damage Oof. not bad not bad wait my power's ready Yeah, this is a steep boy. I don't think I've been over here yet. But considering I haven't found anything yet, I doubt anything is over here. Oh, look, mushrooms. Like, what if this needs to be in my inventory? Like, in my hot bar? I don't think that would make a difference, would it? What was that? Could have swore I heard something. Oh, hello. I did. What is... That's a drake? Oh, okay. I did not know you were going to be up here. Thankfully, you don't seem too tanky. I haven't been hit by you yet, so I have no idea how much you hurt. Holy crap. I was not ready for that. Frost arrows and freeze glands. Okay. Oh, there's another Drake. Okay. I need to be careful because I really don't know how much damage those guys do. But they're relatively easy to take down. I'm only using uh, flint head arrows too. But then again, my iron bow is upgraded to max, so... <laughs> More drakes gonna show up out of nowhere? I had no idea. Oh, lag. What does Rootstone say? If you've found our way to these mountains, we were 20 and now we are two. Agda is dying and Draugr Arrow lies near her heart. I will bid her farewell beside the stone and give her ashes to the wind. Then I will turn my face to the highest peak and seek out the winged one. May Odin give me death or glory. I don't think he made it. Just a uh, just a hunch. I don't know what tells me that, but I don't I don't think he made it. I think I was down here before, but this is like a weird rock. For... That's the first time it's gone off. So that means I'm close to something, right? Like what is what is this? This isn't just a rock formation, is it? It is just what the, what kind of rock formation was that? Okay, so it's glowing. Sitting deposit. So it is further up, I think. Wait. It's getting higher pitch, too. Okay, I know you're going up. I gotta deal with these guys. That went right under his wing. So I'm pretty sure it's just in this rock, right? Yeah, because I'm getting further away from it. Right, come back over here so I can get your stuff, Mr. Drake. Oh, that missed. Ow! Well, that's an obsidian deposit. All right, Mr. Skelly Man, I'm tired of you. Oh, okay. Was not expecting that. Oh, 
You have to... Oh. Okay, doesn't do much damage. Oh, you're gonna roll down the hill. Ah, oh, you bitch. Oh, give me your stuff. <laughs> what did he give me before that? So I have a freeze gland, and I thought the Drake could drop something else for me. I guess not. Weird how this breaks apart like this. Freezing, oh no, uh, drink. Yeah, it's less frequent here. Maybe if I just dig further down. Do I need to dig into the mountain? Like how far do I need to dig? Or is it more over here? I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. What am I doing, guys? I don't know. Is it in here? I don't... <laughs> I don't know. Okay, hang on. Let me time this. One. One. So that's every one second. Over here. That's a little faster. Down here, it's a little faster as well. Here, let me go out this way. I need to bring my other pickaxe so it can do most of this work. Oh, hello. Oh, I see now, okay. So this is what I'm looking for. I went through all of that. Caught. Well, we found silver. Let's go. Although rather, in a weird circumstance. It's going to look ugly on this map. Oh, I guess it goes away after I start mining. Oh, it's not guaranteed. Oh. There we go. Ooh, this is bigger than I thought. Cool. Oh my god, it's so big. And my pick says is out. Uh, Alright, well. Let's go deal with our Drake friend. Actually, I'm going to take all this stone back. At least some of it. Because I will need stone for my uh, stone structures. Alright, I will come back to you whenever I can. Alright, so I've got 15 silver. It can't be teleported, so we're going to make our way back home. Oh, this is straight up a silver vein right here. Just, just sticking out in the open. Whoa, what is... What's over here? What is this? Dragon egg? I mean, I'm full. Okay, I guess. I'll just call it Deg for short. And I'll see if I can mine these guys a whole dragon egg. Uh, okay. What? There's golems? That, okay, all right. Oh, that was a big meaty slam. Okay. I doubt arrows are gonna do anything to you, but I just wanna see. Yeah, all right, just just thigh check. That was a big meaty slam. Uh, I can't get someone right now. He's following me. Will he be able to? Of course he will. Can I? Oh, 10 seconds. I kind of want to fight it and see what if he drops anything. Alright. Come over. What was that? I just saw that. Yeah. Oh. You little bitch. Alright. I'll try and parry you. 
or your AI is going to break. Oh, that's not good. I don't much appreciate you. No. Oh my gosh. This is bad. Are they meaning to shoot at it? Ugh. All right, you're dead. Yeah, you're. Okay, they're not friendly towards each other. Ah, I can parry you. Haha. <laughs> you just like to delay your attacks, though, and I don't like that. I don't want to fight near the dragon egg. Still delayed your hits. Ooh, there we go. I'm out of stamina. Oh. Ooh. Listen, listen. Stop. <laughs> Oh, I thought that would kill him. There we go. Oh, he's made of crystals. Okay. I want to pick those up. Because I don't know what those are. It's a lot of stone. Don't know what crystals are for, but maybe they're a decoration. I missed. Oh. You little bugger. There we go. Well, that was eventful. Holy crap. <laughs> I didn't think I would get chased down by a stone golem. Good lord. Okay. Well, I killed it. And I have crystals now. Uh, yeah, just gonna... <laughs> I gotta get out of here. Oh my god. For more drakes or something spawn. It is nighttime. Ow. 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 Yay. Oh, he did a lot of damage, though. Holy crap. Alright. I'll be right back. Probably gonna fast forward. So I don't have like too much. I know I probably haven't been talking too much in this episode or saying anything interesting. Um, honestly, just don't know what to say. Most of the areas I went to were really new, and so I was just kind of focused on like, okay, what's uh, what's new here? Didn't really find a whole lot except for a freaking stone golem and a dragon egg. What was that? Oh, hello. Silver shield, iron sword, silver sword. Where is? Oh, the cape would be the workshop right okay so this protects against the cold it takes 20 silver i was five short so let me see if that unlocked a recipe for this is one thing i like about mountains though because like look how close that is compared to like the freaking swamp or even the plains in the future so running here actually or running to the mountains actually isn't too difficult i need a wolf trophy okay so that's why that's not unlocked yet so i just need to go kill more wolves Okay, I might do that before this. Uh, you know, what? I'll make that the uh, the milestone for this episode. It's getting a wolf trophy. There we go. All nicely organized and reset. This looks. Ah, uh, this it doesn't bother me as much. I wish stone was even. God dang it! I guess that's what wood is for. But whatever, that's taken care of. All right, let's go get the rest of the resources on that mountain. No, we not get. So, oh yeah, there's that dragon egg. Let's go get the dragon egg. And hopefully nothing bad will happen, question mark. 
But I really want that wolf trophy so I can make the wolf cape, and then I won't need these frost resistance potions anymore. That's the dragon egg over here. Oh my god, all the stone from the freaking elemental, good lord. Oh no. Hello. Wish I did not slide down. I so parried that. What? There we go. Gotta get my stamina back. I'm hoping it's lar- oh god. Can I get a parry, please? I'm hoping it's large hitbox, just kinda- See, did it heal? There we go. Oh, I didn't get, um, okay. Just gonna grab that. Okay. Your Drake buddy, real, okay. Come on. Do I hear another one awakening? I think I do. I want to deal with you right now, Drake's. Oh, that's a Drake trophy. Let's go. Oh, what? Oh, a Drake helmet. Okay. Carrying too much. Ow. What? Cool. I wonder if the stone... Oh, this is not... Far heavier than it looks with the... 200 weight? What the heck? <laughs> okay. All right, Mr. Wolf. Ow, you attacked faster than... Oh, no trophy, but I will gladly take your pelts. Why do you guys do this? Why do you feel the need to do this? Oh, lag, why? Really? That missed. All right. There we go. Good lord. Why did you feel the need to do go through all that, Mr. Drake? Okay, I don't know what's going on up there. Hello, Mr. Stone Golem. Oh, okay. Oh, is he stuck? How much damage does this do again? I know it did like nothing. I mean, that's not bad. You. Oh. oh. <laughs> okay. So nothing gets along with the stone golems up here. Oh. I guess that's what that noise was earlier. It was just him killing a bunch of wolves. All right. I know you probably can't, but I would like to tame a stone golem to be my personal killing machine, please. All right, Mr. Golem, you seem to be uh, stuck, step golem. There it is. Oh, this isn't good. This is not where I want to be. Uh...
But he also seems to be stuck, so it's okay. I just gotta wait. <laughs> Do these things have trophies? I don't know what they would have for trophies if they did. Yeah, right, I'll just wait here. We're chilling. We're buddies. We're buddies. Isn't that right, Mr. Gollum? I'm just giving you some friendly pats on the back. Key uppercut. Hug. I missed. See, we're for. Uh. I didn't hit. What the hell? Why didn't that hit? I am so lucky to be alive. Oh my god. <sighs> I'm so lucky the AI wasn't that good. Oh my lord. Hit him. Ah. Please, please, please. Yes! Okay. Let's get out of here. Yay! <laughs> I am legitimately happy. Let's go. We're going to immediately upgrade that because yes. And again, because yes. I like how... That's crazy. So I can upgrade this twice. The wolf one twice without fifth level but to upgrade the troll one twice you need the fifth Ugh. to four that's just that's three that that's stupid that's so stupid but whatever you know what <laughs> cool i love it i love it i love it all right the song what is this like Ooh, that's pretty. I like that. All right. So there we go. Made a l at least at least to me, I made a lot of progress today. I wasn't expecting to kill a boss and immediately start making the next tier of armor. I will need to go get more silver and more iron. Right, guys. That is uh, me playing Valheim. I don't know if I'm gonna record this more. Like I said, I've been really addicted to this game. I've just been playing it a lot, a lot. <laughs> So I might be making more of these in the future. I'm not sure. It just kind of depends on what kind of mood I'm in. We'll see. But um, yeah, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like, subscribe, comment, do whatever. And I will see you next time.